Hello everyone and welcome back to the Tech Enthusiast channel and in this video I will show you how to get folders in Windows 11 start menu. So as you probably see this isn't done by Windows 11 natively, however it is done by third party application called start 11 from stardock so this is the basically windows customization program that customizes the start menu as well as taskbar however it isn't completely free so if i go to the their web page and here i'll click get it now uh, as you can see it's seven euros uh, however if you want to try it you have 30 days trial and you can get this exe file from this website and then you will also need to register to or use the mail to actually activate the trial of the program once you got the program installed it will look like something like that however if i right click on the on the star doc uh, curtains this start menu you will see that we have a few options of the um, start menu right here we have an option to disable or enable the start 11 and then we also have some styles so for example here we have windows 7 style it looks something like that then we have the modern style it looks something like that we have the windows 10 style it looks something like that and then we also at least we have the windows 11 style and it looks basically quite similar to the default windows 11 start menu here you also have the options to customize your preferred choice or your preferred design of the start menu. Here you can add or uh, delete few shortcuts from the start menu. And then you also have an option to customize menu visual appearance. So what will this will do is to make, for example, make menu font bigger or smaller. Then you can also use automatic color for the start menu or you can pick the color manually. You also have an option to adjust menu transparency. For example, I have set it right here to the 50%, but let's say I have 30, let's, some, let's say something like that, and it's transparent even more as you can see right here. Then you also have an options to change visual effects on the menu. For example, you can uh, disable around the corners of the menu and menu elements. You can disable that as well. As you can see, the start menu is currently quite square. Um, but I quite like this feature that everything is rounded and really nice and rounded. However, you also have an option to animate the menu when opening it. And you also have an option to offset the menu from the taskbar and also to not offset the menu horizontally to ensure it lines up with the start button. You can also enable this feature as well. Then the main thing about this program or in the current release Make sure that you have the release 1.1 because in this version they got a feature that allows users to add folders to the Windows or Start 11 uh, start menu, right? So I'll show you how to get the folders. So if I go to the start menu or start 11 start menu, should I say, here you will right click on the, on the start menu and here you have a new option that's called create a new um, or pin new folder so here you will select or pin the new folder and this will basically create a shortcut to your folder for example i'll go to the this pc then i'll go to the local disk c and go to the users and i'll go to my uh, user uh, folder right and i'll click ok right here and as you can see the folder was created and if i click on it it should um, go to the this folder of the user tech enthusiast so this is pretty much it for the folders however here you also have an option to let's say to pin a file for example you have one file that you wanted pinned on your start menu and then you can also simply do that by uh, selecting the file and opening it and as you can see the file is pinned or pinned in this start 11 start menu you can easily separate this uh, apps with uh, a new groups for example uh, let's say you have um, a brand new group let's say we have the group called work and for example in this uh, group you will you will easily put in apps or pin the apps and folders related to 
your work and uh, you can also create a new page right here as you can see this um, program also allows you to add a few pages to the start menu as you can see we have a new page right here and we can easily pin or even create a few more, more pages or pin even more uh, programs and folders to this specific brand new page uh, as you can see this program has a lot features to offer and i think it is quite good i think that it's worth trying it for 30 days and then maybe consider it buying it for seven euros um and but this is your your choice right if you want to you can easily uh, spend the seven uh, euros on something else however this program also uses quite nice features and right now in this re release of 1.1 i believe um, as option to add some folders to the start menu and with that said i hope you enjoyed this quick video how to add folders to windows 11 start menu and if you did subscribe to the channel would be much appreciated and also like this video for the youtube algorithm with all that being said have a wonderful rest of your day and i see you guys in the next video peace